looking back, um, my mom um, and my dad was divorced. Um, we didn't have a lot of money. Um, my mom had different kind of men all the time. Um, she wasn't around most of the time. Um, they had some uh, mental, physical abuse, as well as sexual abuse from my cousins. And my cousin Connie was the first person that ever molested me. My downward spiral began when, um, <clears throat> when my nanny died. Um, my mom's mom. Uh, I got really depressed. Um, I started doing things that I, I wouldn't have normally did. And then I started drinking started drinking and then I started doing uh, smoking weed. I started doing coke, ecstasy, you know, just anything I got my hands on until I got to where I started using the needle with <clears throat> meth, heroin, subutex, you know, crack anything that I could, didn't matter. You know, I, I did anything and everything. My downward spiral was caused by um, me, I realized I was at rock, rock bottom and needed help. <clears throat> Whenever um, I had nothing, I was roaming the streets. Um, I lost the boyfriend that I was with after he beat me up again. Um, in and out of abusive relationships over and over again. I heard about the New Orleans mission from my mom. Um, her friend um, that was living with her at the time, said that she brought people here and um, I, I didn't really know what it was before I came. All I knew is that it was a program. I thought it was a rehab, you know what I'm saying, to get me off drugs and um, but so much more, <laughs> so much more than what I thought. The moment I accepted God as my savior, um, I was here um, at Lynn Haven. Um, and I struggled with the accepting that for a while, um, doubting my salvation. Um, I doubted it a lot. And um, I was always in fear and, and not believing what God's done for me. Where I was in addiction, um, I, was, um, I was in the dark. The lies that I used to believe about myself were um, I was a junkie. I was never gonna get well. Um, I was crazy, I was stupid, I was a liar. Um, you know, I was, I was lost. Today in life I am moving forward in God, trusting Him in all things. Um, after graduation, I plan on staying at Lynn Haven, continuing working and um, just staying in the Word of God until He um, set something else up for me. To be forgiven, <laughs> it feels amazing. Um, not having to worry about um, the things that I've done or the things that I might do, knowing that we was born into sin, knowing that our sinful nature is in us, regardless if we want to accept that or not, knowing that there's nothing that I can do to be accepted by God, knowing that His love is unconditional, something that I've never had before. My name is Brianna and I'm a disciple.